Okay, Business 110 class, Jeff Myers, and I want to talk to you briefly about the difference between a manager and a leader. Big difference. Businesses out there are looking for leadership, not managers. Managers assume that their employees don't want to be at work. Managers are called the boss. Nobody follows managers. Managers like to sit in their big offices with their door shut. Managers have other people train the people that work for them. Uh, managers really aren't available most of the time to their employees. They're too busy. Uh, managers use the term I, and you better increase your performance. You better get things done for me. Management days are typically over. Managers are the first ones to get let go when there's a layoff. Uh, let's get rid of middle management. What we're looking for is a leader. A uh, leader is somebody who assumes people want to come to work. Leader assumes their people want responsibility. Leaders assume that people want additional work and, and like the camaraderie of coming into work and like to be recognized. Leaders say we can do it together. Leaders train their people on the job that needs to be done. They show the people that work for them that they can do this job. Uh, leaders are typically the ones people follow. Leaders don't sit in their office all day. Leaders are usually out on customer appointments or training their employees or sitting one-on-one -on -one with them or motivating them daily somehow. They're not spending their time in the office doing marketing and budgets. That can be done at the end of the day, early morning, or at home. Leaders are there as part of a team and they motivate their employees every single day. Managers may motivate once in a while, positively, uh, but use negative reinforcement management and threats all the time. So you can see that today, if you're a manager, and you think that you're in this position to kind of boss people all day and threaten people all day and only motivate them once a year at the Christmas party or that money is a motivating factor only, uh, you are not going to make it in this career or as an entrepreneur because entrepreneurs are the same thing, either a manager or a leader. Leadership understands that motivation is different between everybody. Some people are motivated more by money. Some people are motivated by extra responsibility. Some people are motivated by materialistic goods. Some people are motivated just with a handshake and hey, great job. Some people are motivated because, um, or they're motivated, uh, recognized in a public setting, like at a meeting or on email. There are 50 different ways to motivate people. Uh, the plaque of the month, employee parking of the month, gift certificates to Ruth Chris Steakhouse, for you and your partner. Whatever it is, leaders understand that we're all motivated by different things and they practice that every day. Managers think that money is the only motivation and therefore they give out a bonus uh, at the Christmas party or at the quarterly um, uh, meeting or whatever. So a huge, huge difference between leadership and management. And motivation is really tied to success with businesses. So uh, I just wanted to kind of go over that briefly and I'll probably speak a little bit more about motivating techniques in the next video, but it's really important that you understand the differences between what a leader is and that of a manager. Take care.